Oh my god. <laughs> Boobies! Hey y'all, happy Valentine's Day. Today we're checking out how Amberlynn celebrated Valentine's Day through the years. Good morning, everybody. Okay, it's not really morning, it's like the afternoon. Crystal and I are about to go on our Valentine's date day slash night. I wanted to show you my outfit of the day. I'm wearing a pink sweater like I wore yesterday. This one's just in pink. Silver diamond heart ring that I got from Avenue. Triangle diamondy silvery necklace that I really, really like. It's so pretty. Got it from Charlotte Ruse. These really pretty pink flowered earrings with diamonds in the middle that I got from Charlotte Ruse. My hair is just in a wonderful bun. That's my outfit. Well, Crystal's gonna surprise me. I have no idea where we're going to eat. She's gonna be driving us there, and I'm totally gonna be surprised. All right, you guys, we've arrived, and Crystal knows me well enough to know that Indian cuisine is my favorite. Yay! She knows me so well, as I do her. Got my water. Cheers. <laughs> this place is so pretty. I mean, it's no Yamato's, but whatever. They have like a little waterfall over there. I always get the chicken dahania. I can't say it. It's hot with boneless chunks of chicken cooked in a cilantro and jalapeno based curry sauce. It's so good. They have a buffet going on right now until three, but I like to order what I always get. Crystal always gets the same thing too, which is it? The chicken biryani, boneless chicken cooked with saffron basamati <laughs> rice, <laughs> marinated with herbs, spices, and nuts. We're heading into the mall right now. Try to walk as fast as possible because I don't have a jacket on it. It's so windy. Can have some clothes. You can never have too many clothes. Who's with me on that one? I don't know. I feel like when they start to pile up on the bathroom counter, that might be a sign that you have too many clothes. So, <laughs> I added my new Tory clothes on top of Mount Torrid. Some cute floral stuffs. My question is who would buy cards that say 50 farts? <laughs> this is another one of those things I was talking about. It's milk chocolate for life's boo-boos. That's just teaching people to eat when they're sad. That's so bad. That's pretty funny coming from the girl that once said this. I got some very bad news today. I take my mind off of it with some dumplings, so... Look at those clouds. It's supposed to snow, so... Crystal and I are actually going to a movie to see Still Alice. I think her mom wants to see Still Alice as well, so I think we're all gonna go. I'm pretty sure her mom will drive, but the weather out here looks really, really horrendous, and it's super windy and literally so freezing, like 20 degrees. <laughs> there was a change of plans. We didn't end up going to the movie. We came home to drop off a few things from when we went shopping. Power was flickering, and we didn't feel like leaving the animals home in case the power did come out because it's super cold outside. Like, I think it's at five degrees now. We didn't want to leave them in the cold like that. So if the power did go out, we wanted to like snuggle with them. <laughs> we stayed home and just played some board games. We might go see the movie tomorrow. I'm not too sure. I hope you guys had a great day today. I know I did. <laughs> I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. We are now jumping forward one year and into the Destiny era. Oh, also, Amberlynn has a cold sore, fever blister, herpes, whatever you want to call it on her lip. And she's decided the best way to deal with that is to just cover her face. So let's go. Destiny said that there is a surprise for me on the table. Today is Wednesday. Valentine's Day is until Saturday, but we have, or Sunday. But we work Sunday and we have the day off today. So we're going to celebrate it today. <laughs> We're gonna go out to eat, we might go to the movies, and stuff like that. And I just woke up, so I look like a hot mess. Yeah, what so, Cupid brought you. Did she just say, let's see what Cupid brought you? Yeah, what Cupid so, brought you. 
Does she think Cupid is like Santa and brings gifts to you on Valentine's Day? Let's see. Oh, uh, whoa. <laughs> a huge, oh, can you turn on the light? A huge card and a balloon. Well, I got you the hot air balloon. because That's a hot air balloon? Oh, well, this is in the air. So cute! Look at the fan. Maybe <laughs> the fan's hitting the balloon. Don't let it hit oh too much, baby. Move it. Wait. Come here. My lip is so bad. It is so embarrassing. Okay. Bay didn't get me any chocolate because this girl don't need no chocolate. Bay ain't wrong. Oh my god. This is can you guys see this? I sure hope so. There's no such thing as too much love. And it's two foxes. Oh, they're so cute. You know me because this card is so cute. Whoa. Look it. So happy I get to share today and every day with you. My partner, my love, my best friend. Happy Valentine's Day. I love you, baby. You're my moon and all my stars. Girl, you stole that from a poem. It's still pretty sweet though. You're the sweetest little thing I've ever seen. Careful my lip. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Tell them where we're going to eat. Laja. Laja, which is a? Mexican restaurant. Libby has made a mess over there. But yeah, Laja oh. is a Mexican restaurant. And I'm super excited because I haven't had like authentic Mexican food in a really long time. So, <laughs> isn't she the cutest? Look at that. It's so pretty in here. They have this really pretty fountain. Woo! How's it taste? <laughs> so we just got done eating at the restaurant which was super freaking good like i was craving mexican food like really bad i think we might go to the mall and just like walk around i don't know we're just gonna see where the night takes us and stuff so dinner and then a trip to the mall seems like this valentine's is going exactly the way it did last year with crystal no. bae wants to get me a gumball do you have another quarter? I want one of these. Sure. No, I don't have my purse with me. Oh. Strawberry banana. I saved us some change. I got Thank the dollars. You. Tell me if it tastes good. It's 18 minutes with two on it. So we're in the mall. I'm gonna go to Charlotte Ruse, so that's what we're gonna do. I mean, it tastes good. It it's gonna take me a minute to. And now. Oh my god. <laughs> Boobies. What? So apparently this girl didn't need any chocolate, but she did need some ice cream. Classic Amberlynn Reed moment coming in three, two, one. Off to Tarjay. Ow. That was special. I want to jump off. Yeah. I'm scared. My feet hurt a little. I'm wearing the wrong <laughs> shoes. Jump. And this is higher than it looks, okay, you guys? Jump. I can't. I'm scared. Take it. I'm actually scared right now. <laughs> wow, look at that terrifying six inch drop off. Jump. <laughs> that was not jumping, that was falling with style. I did not fall. We're now going two years into the future in 2018 and it's the Beck era.
So happy Valentine's Day. Today is Valentine's Day and Becky surprised me. This is going to be funny to some of you guys, but she surprised me with this game. Um, we've been wanting this guess who game. I know it's ridiculous. And she surprised me with a movie, Mr. Deeds. A board game and an Adam Sandler movie. And they say romance is dead. And she got me chocolates. Look how cute. And she also got me a rose, but it's currently in water. So I'm just going to get ready. And actually, Becky and I were just going to kind of like celebrate the day together. But then Destiny just FaceTimed me and she's like, you want to go on a double date? So I think we're going to do like a double date, which is really awesome. So what I'm hearing is it's Valentine's Day and Destiny doesn't have the money to take her girl out to dinner. So she's going to let Amberlynn foot the bill. It's just crazy. Like how different my life is now compared to a year ago a year ago on valentine's day i was like on you now and i was making a youtube video drinking a whole thing of wine it's just so weird and now i'm just like hi <laughs> like happier and with this one right here oh hi baby <laughs> so we are finally about to leave i am so hungry and i'm so excited Valentine's Day. So we're er we are currently, I was gonna say we're early, I don't know why I said that. We're currently at Bath and Body Works and I think I'm gonna pick out little gifts for Eric, Ricky, um, for sure Dana, and other oh, some Valentine's Day stuff. Cause Dana, side note, Dana's the only person who got me something for Valentine's Day last year. So I kinda wanna make it up to her. Wait, so you're telling me that a month after Destiny broke up with her for Dana, her very first Valentine's Day without Destiny, Dana got her a gift? That is either the sweetest or the bitchiest thing I've ever heard of. <laughs> Wait, what are you trying to do? Like, it's not You lipstick. have to be central. Yeah, we're supposed to rub it around the lip. Uh, well, I don't know. <laughs> I've never done this. That's ridiculous. Uh, Here's okay. I don't know how to be sensual, so let's just be normal. No, you don't have to do anything. Oh, okay. okay, okay. You're just supposed to open your mouth. Okay. okay. <laughs> and then you're supposed to just like entice them and then like, and then. What? <laughs> hey, ho. Oh my god. I told you. I mean, strawberry is chocolates. Hey. Chocolate covered strawberries. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone is here. What, eggs? Aww. Or chocolate covered eggs. Thank you. <laughs> Wait, I like eggs too, though. Let chocolate me, covered eggs. I already <laughs> gave Eric and Ricky his stuff. I'm sure it wouldn't be too bad with just a white part. Ooh, but with the yolk, I don't know. No. That is body work. Yeah, it smells good. It's a boy she kind. No, it's it she was like, so, talking about like, uh, Eggs, and she's like, I like those. And I was like, what? Eggs? Spray it on your body. And then I said, chocolate chocolate eggs. So you like it? Yeah. What is it, bourbon? Yeah. A bunch of stuff from there. Of course, she points out that it's a bunch of stuff. That stuff smells so good. You've smelt it before? Yeah. Yes. We went yesterday. The watermelon lemonade. Oh my god, I could drink that. <laughs> if it wasn't so. Oh, do you? Awesome. It's a mermaid bath mermaid bomb. Bomb. I saw you in the bath on your hey. Snapchat the other night. <laughs> I got her the unicorn glitter one. That smells really good. So uh -huh. I just got the small yeah. one because I wasn't we sure if you like it. We were like a but yeah. Thank you. You're Twinkie. welcome. Oh, Twinkie. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Look at Cho. Oh, excited. Hi guys. Oh. Hi, hi, hi. oh. Well, I hope you guys had a great Valentine's Day or just a great day in general. I had a, an amazing day. We're now gonna fast forward two years to 2020. Let's see what Beck got Amberlynn for Valentine's Day. Hello, so it is Valentine's Day and I wanted to show you what Becky got me. This cute little bear that says, be my Valentine. I am obsessed with Ariel, she's actually my favorite. So she got me this really pretty, like, it's like a painting, but it's on glass and it has a little stand so you don't have to hang it up. I love that. And my most favorite flowers, roses and baby's breath. Oh, so. Sorry. Sorry. 
Next up is 2022 and 2023. We are now in the wifey slash Feline era. Let's see what she got in Berlin. So today is February 14th. It is Valentine's Day. So happy Valentine's Day. So I wanted to show you guys something. It's something else that my girlfriend got me for Valentine's Day. She surprised me on Valentine's Day. I had no idea. Tell me these aren't the most gorgeous roses. You have ever seen with baby's breath. Like she knows me so well. So I did have some people asking what I got her for Valentine's Day. So some of it is personal. Thank you for keeping that to yourself. I don't even want to guess what she's talking about. And then I got her a couple things I just knew she would like. But one of the main things besides the personal stuff was I got her some Jordans. She has already worn them. She does collect shoes. She loves Jordans. And I think Jordans look just like amazing on her. So that's what they look like. I know nothing about Jordan. So you guys let me know in the comments if that's a good gift or not. One year later. So I want to show you the roses that Feline got me for Valentine's Day. I was not expecting it at all. Um, I woke up and she was like, come in the office, come in the office. And I was like, why? Why do you want me in there it's so bad? And she just had those waiting for me. And I just thought it was so sweet. I actually cried a little. I'm that dumb. I'm that pathetic. I'm that much of a romantic. So those are Amberlynn's Valentine's Days through the years, at least the ones where she had a girlfriend. Let me know your predictions of how she'll celebrate Valentine's Day this year as a single girly pop down in the comments.